Her. Are you having fun, Rico? Huh? Rita's just back there playing on the swing, isn't she? Lots of exercise, lots of food to throw on the floor, all kinds of fun, huh? Yes, you guys are having a blast, aren't you, Rita? Yes, you are. This is the jungle gym that we play on almost every single day after work. And that's Rita's swing. She has claimed it. She loves getting on it and twirling around and then spinning more than swinging back and forth. Now Rico often jumps on this netting that's right over here on the edge of the, the surrounding the, the balcony that we have. And they have an entire yard to just gaze at and appreciate and and socialize in with other birds. The other blue and gold that I told you about is uh, Romeo. So we've got Romeo and Rico and Rita. All three R's for our three macaws. And all three of them, they get along fairly well. We don't put Romeo with Rico and Rita, only because even though that we've never seen any aggression between the three of them, we don't want to chance it. They've only been together for a few months now. So they've been able to talk and socialize with each other, but they don't, they don't have close contact. We've got plenty of space to fly on this balcony, and Rico often does. He'll zoom around in a circle, maybe even do one or two laps around the balcony, because it's a fairly long balcony. And uh, he usually attaches himself to the netting that's beside me, and then he swings back and forth on the netting. And he has lots of fun and gets plenty of exercise. It's very shaded back here. And when it's too hot out, when it's about 97 degrees or higher, we usually bring them inside to the air conditioner because they might be wild birds, but they're domesticated, and I don't want them to suffer in any kind of heat. If it's too hot for me, it's too hot for my birds. But we play with them every single day, and they climb on the ropes that Rita was trying to grab and they pick on each other and they have fun. And we've we've gotten good at picking them up and handling them every single day, even my three kids. They can pick up both Rita and Rico with no problems and nobody's worried about getting seriously bitten. Rico has his temper sometimes, but we just listen to his body language and appreciate that he's he can say no, and he makes up his own mind if he wants to go somewhere or not. And this weekend, we're thinking about taking him to Petco just to walk around and get a treat, have some fun. Say bye-bye, birds. You say bye-bye? Bye-bye. -bye? <laughs>